what's up all you fishing addicts out there so check it out what we're going to do today is going to be a different episode of tasty tuesday check out the gear y'all uh so first things first i'm gonna start uh doing some merch i know it's a little bit early on but i got some pretty sweet ideas sweet logos gonna be top quality fishing gear uh i'll put some pics on the instagram so you can definitely go and check those out some of my ideas and we'll go from there all right so first things first what we are going to do is we're going to get out of the water and onto the land so i have a special episode of tasty tuesday we're going to be doing smoked ribs smoked chicken and some smoked rabbit all right some fresh caught killed cleaned up yummy rabbit all right so I'm going to show you what the ingredients are and I'm going to walk you through it real quick. So check this out. Let me just go ahead and flip the camera around. So what we have here is we have our cut chicken and the, what you're going to do is going to smoke this on 250 for at least your first, uh, first hour skin side down. What I've used is the Everglades rub just a straight up everglades rub and then after that you all know how to smoke chicken gonna flip it back over wrap it in foil go from there next we have another version of chicken this is hawaiian chicken so this has been sitting in a marinade overnight and we are using no barbecue hawaiian sauce okay you can find this at your local um Asian food market, uh, or if you can, you can get some Kalani's. Just Google it. That's what I used to use in Hawaii when I was stationed there. And then we'll go ahead and do that the same way, skin side down for some char marks. And here we have a nice rack of ribs. What I'm using for this is the Everglades Cactus Dust, and I also am using the Everglades rib and pork rub so here is the money maker some nice fresh caught chopped up cleaned up nice drained rabbit because i don't want to be demonetized later on and we are also going to be using some of the organ meat so there's your lungs there's your liver which is very high in iron and and a little rabbit heart so we're gonna take all these throw them in there and i wanted to show you the uh way i'm going to do this so first we are going to get our base and i like to use uh we're going to be putting some heat in it later so i'm going to do is start with some sunny's barbecue sweet sauce if you all know sunny's it's a southern thing great so being this is our base we're gonna go ahead and drizzle some of that on there <laughs> all right so we got just and i'm doing it for flavor so just if you, you're watching it's kind of what i do and then we go ahead and we're gonna give a little more natural sweet so i just take some pure maple syrup the real maple syrup not the the uh the fake kind made from from uh, other stuff because you, you'll be able to tell the difference because it's really watery so we'll just take that and you don't need a lot now some people are saying oh why didn't you brine it if you're gonna oh well, rabbit is a very uh a very mild flavor so a lot like chicken and as you can notice the meat is very similar in color and texture to chicken oh, looks like a little butt all right get that off there then next we are going to drop in some habanero peach hot sauce it's really really not that hot i promise you sorry about that i had to uh get the cap off i need to and so like i said this is a medium you can get it at Bucky's if you do not have a Bucky's. Obviously, you're not in Texas or one of the outlying areas. But I'm telling you what, this stuff is 
fantastic. And we're just going to go ahead and drizzle a little bit of that peach habanero to give it that peachy. Nice. I know you're thinking, oh, it's a lot of sweet. All right, well, it's also going to cancel out a lot of that gamey flavor. And then we got Swift Burn. These actually come in a pack of uh, five. This is the first one I took out. These are really good. So I'm going to add some smoky bourbon. Since we're smoking it, a little bit of hot sauce there, just to drizzle it up. Now I'm going to mix this by hand and then we're going to wrap it in some foil. And then the first thing we're going to do is put this on the Traeger, skin side down for one hour to get a nice glaze. Then you'll see. Be back in a flash. First. Sauce first? Sauce first and then that little sauce. Okay. Well, I'm recording now. So. Okay, so guys, we took the ribs off. We got nice, it's not done cooking yet, but you can see it's got a nice texture on top. So what we're gonna do is we take some of our B-dubs, barbecue, the, uh, what is it, the honey, honey barbecue. We just sauce it up. that and then get your handy dandy little uh basting brush spread that sauce over it all nice and good after that take some butter Little nice little chunk there, chunk there, chunk, chunk, and a little more for good luck. Now, what we're going to do is I'm going to rewrap this, put this on the grill for another, or the uh. The smoker for another um, hour or so it should be nice and done so it's at 250 and then I'm gonna put these skin side down and this chicken skin side down all right see you in a minute all right we got our chicken got the Traeger Ooh. Booyah. So what I'm gonna do is set this down. Take this chicken. Have the skin side down. That's falling everywhere. facing down and go ahead put it in there we got our chicken chicken ribs so this is on 250 let it smoke for approximately an hour hour and a half and then from there once that's done 
I'm gonna go ahead and get the rabbit because we're gonna put the rabbit on there at about two, 240 ish. All right, see you in a few. All right, that was your completed ribs. Mmm, steamy. You can see it's perfectly done. Next up, we'll be getting up the chicken. What's up, guys? Yeah, Jackson's excited, right? All right, so inside I've already taken the smoked chicken and and that. I've already taken the smoked chicken and the ribs. Now it's for the unveiling. Chicken uh, and rabbit. Uh, Always serve rabbit with a little bit of uh, lettuce. And then, of course, you got some rice. Uh, Tuckerbird uh, uh, stuff ready to go. Uh, and some uh, sweet, gentle meat. Uh, Alright, guys, I hope you uh, like this, enjoyed it, uh, and can use uh, some of this stuff at home. Sorry about that. There's another one. My dad. And in the meantime, stay frosty, get the lines tight. Rod's bed. Peace.